in order to use the filter function in Excel, and here's an Excel spreadsheet that has lots of fields and lots of data, here's what we do. We move our mouse in the home page to sort and filter, click the small arrow to the right, and we see a drop down list, and we hit filter. Once that happens, you see every single cell in row one has a small arrow box that enables us to filter the information in that column so let's look at description column g we're looking at all of the different grade bands that the schools are associated with if we hit the arrow button now we see all the different grade bands here if we only want to see high schools, then we deselect all of the schools and, cl and click only high school. That sorts it. We will escape this so we don't see this in the way. That sorts it so we only see high schools. Well, some high schools are secondary schools. So as we scroll down, we see only high schools. So if we want to add more schools to this list, you simply go back to that, which is now a funnel shape because it's indicating that it's filtered. We hit it again, the drop down list reappears, and now we have a category that says secondary schools. So now we want to see all the high schools and all the secondary schools, we hit secondary school. And now we have the complete list of all of the 6 to 12 schools. Secondary is 6 to 12. High schools are 9 to 12 in our Excel list. Notice that none of the schools are deleted. It's just filtering for the schools that we want. If we wanted to avoid using the filter all the time, what we could do is click this box here and for the triangle and it highlights everything we now go up to edit and we hit copy now all of these cells are copied and we can add a new tab click paste Now, this is a big file, so we'll wait. And now we have all of the high schools and secondary schools on one page. So then we can go ahead and name, rename this sheet to, to 6 through 12. So that gives us the ability to avoid the filter And just go right to the 6 12. so we'll just go back to here we don't need the filter here any longer because we have the sec separate page with 6 to 12. we'll go back here and we'll hit select all close this and now we have all of the schools again on one page and the 6 to 12 separately